or actually what it's asking. Brink, do you think that was an attempt to communicate with us? Was your pulling the wire an attempt to communicate with them? Did it ever occur to you that maybe if they wanted to communicate with us, they'd just come up and talk? Thanks. Right. Do you think we could climb this slope? No use. It doesn't go up all the way to the top. The engravings on this wall, are they writing or decoration? You're asking us? <laughs> yeah. Climb the slope, huh? Dirt ramp. It seems to be pointing at this mound. Uh -huh, that's the way we did it. With that device pointing at this mound, I suspect there might be something buried here. How scientific of you, Commander. Another random hole bulldozed by our fearless leader. Maybe not. I thought I saw something shining. An artifact. Bracelet. It looks like a bracelet. It looks like a bracelet. <laughs> a little bit different tone of voice there. It's nice. So we have a bracelet. Uh, wire tusk. Yeah. Nothing but dirt. Okay, can I use the bracelet? This artifact is very delicate. It looks like it may be useful as well as ornamental. I wouldn't mind wearing it, but it's too small for my wrist. portion of skull from an alien creature. Indeed. Aren't we supposed to be able to climb down? Interestingly enough, this part of the game is uh, what I remember the least in the beginning. Oof, here we go. I think we can safely say this is not a natural weather phenomenon. How about a mirage? Anyone voting for it being a mirage? It knew we were here. It was trying to tell us something. Or show us something. Don't be too quick to anthropomorphize. How do we know what life looks like here? It might be alive. Or it might be some kind of automatic guidance system. We triggered it in that ruined ship and now it's leading us. You mean this is the last gasp of a holographic tour guide? Or the port authority. Maybe it's telling us we're under arrest. Come quietly or self-aiming lasers will toast us to cinders in 15 seconds. Stop it. Maybe you can think that's funny, but the last thing I need is some mischievous boy trying to give me the creeps. If I wanted to give you the creeps, I'd tell you that it was the ghost of a long-dead alien. 
How do you know it isn't a ghost? What? You think this is where aliens end up when they die? If it is, then this place better be hell, because it sure isn't my idea of heaven. Now you're starting to give me the creeps. Right. A small hole. It's too small and dark to see if this hole leads anywhere. That shovel sure comes in handy. I'm gonna see if I can enlarge the hole. Maybe there's something under here. Yeah, maybe something lives down in that hole. <laughs> the utterances of experts. The ground is soft here. Loose. I think this used to be an opening, and over the years, wind has filled it up with sand and dirt. Here, let me see. Good. Let bring Kish and use the shovel. Yes, that's right. You're probably right. That means the ground is treacherous. It could be hollow under there. Commander, I think it's time for an archaeologist to do the digging. I'm used to dealing with drifted soil. The shovel is yours, Brink. Just be careful. The ground's pretty unstable. My feet kept sinking. My whole training is to be careful. Not to charge in with guns blazing. Awesome. Finally, a good use for my extensive training. <laughs> in shoveling. No! It's completely... I can't... No! Ah! Oops. Frank! I couldn't get to him in time. I couldn't. It happened too fast. How long a drop is it? Looks like the rubble has formed a ramp. Follow me. Here he is. He's not moving. Brink. Boston. He's dead. I should have been the one digging. Then you'd be the dead one. It was my responsibility to. Brink and I are not children or trained monkeys. We're responsible adults. It could have been any of us, and there's not a thing you could have done to prevent it. But I... to lose Brink, and we've only been up here. Look. You can't keep me safe, and I can't keep you safe. So there's no particular reason for us to stay together. Our odds of getting back to Earth are better if we work separately on figuring this place out. I don't like the idea of splitting up. Why? Because we're safer together? Ask Brink about that. Because maybe I won't know what I'm seeing without you to help me understand it. If you find something interesting, the communicators still work. Till then, Adios. Ciao. Sayonara. A Wiedersehen. Maggie, it's against every rule of military action for an officer to be separated from his command. Boston, this isn't a military action. And you don't have a command. There's just you and me. And we both know exactly the same amount about this situation. Which is to say, nada. Nothing. Zip. If we suddenly find ourselves facing an army, then you're in command again. Until then... Adios. Ciao. Sayonara. A Wiedersehen. Nobody likes you when you smart off like that. Yeah. All my psychological tests as a kid said that I didn't work well with others. So this is what failure feels like. I really like how she says first Ah, it's not your fault, and then immediately goes on to give him a guilt trip <laughs> to justify leaving randomly in an alien, alien environment. Uh, but okay, Brink's body. Let's. You could be irritating sometimes, but you sure didn't deserve to die. That's true. Right, so, uh, reached the underground complex. Yeah, 
let's check it out. No signs of bioluminescence. These plants must be feeding off some underground electrical source. Well, that probably wouldn't hurt too. The plants seem to draw energy from my body and disperse it among all the plants. They must share a common root system. Interesting. This reminds me of the control panel from the asteroid. Maybe if I find all the right metal plates and arrange them the right way, just like before. I think. Doors, doors everywhere. I wonder which one is the pay toilet. dark crystals, some kind of control. So, um, these are some of the puzzles. And, uh, yeah. We'll see about that later. Column. Somebody spent a long time engraving these smooth grooves on the surface of this column. I wish I knew what for. Another one of these engraved sticks. What are they? Wands? Batons? Bludgeons? Maybe some kind of handheld computer game. With my luck, it's a hand grenade. Doors, doors, and a dark tunnel. It's dark in there. This is exactly the kind of place my mother always said I should stay out of. Let's stay out of it for an hour. Plate, here we go. Missed that one. Looks like one of the control plates we found on Attila. So yeah, this is nostalgia, definitely. 18 years ago, around the same time, uh, yeah, probably the exact same time of year, I was playing this.
There is an airtight seal between these two rooms. This looks like a command center. I can see a tunnel that connects to the island I just came from. From this vantage point, I can see a whole system of underwater tunnels. I see many undersea tunnels, all leading from the large central island to the smaller islands. Right, so let's check out the glowing panel. It's an energized crystal. It's an energized crystal. This, one this crystal is lifeless. Exactly. This hole is empty. That won't fit. That won't fit. So, let's try to open some doors. Engraved rod. Purple engraved rod. Well, let's find the purple door first then. I can't help feeling like this thing is some kind of key, but is this the key to this lock? And if it is, how does it work? And why am I talking to myself? How long before I'm completely nuts? Soon. Soon. Right, let's try it. Let's have a look. I don't think this is the door though. What was it? I immediately forgot which um, shape it was. Nothing. 
I don't remember which door is which. But that's how you open them anyway. The door is shut tight. A row of dark crystals, some kind of control. It's a rod, engraved, five geometric shapes. It won't do anything. Yeah, there's something special it's a rod, one. engraved, five geometric shapes. Unfortunately, it takes quite a long time to uh, dial in all the combinations. Would be nice to be sure which door is which. This remembers the position, so... Nope. I think that's correct, at least. Correct, but the wrong door. So we have to do this to test every other door until we find which one it is. Is that supposed to be a uh, square? No.
Oops. Click inside the window, please. We did something wrong. Maybe it's none of these doors. That really is a square. I can't help feeling like this thing is some kind of key. But is this the key to this lock? And if it is, how does it work? And why am I talking to myself? How long before I'm completely nuts? Mm -hmm. It's a rod, engraved, five geometric shapes. Indeed. Uh, I'm gonna make some more coffee, so uh, I'm gonna take uh, a little break. Say, uh, realistically, around seven minutes probably to make coffee and then come back. But uh, yeah, I'll be right back uh, around seven minutes, I think. Okay, right. If we're gonna do any puzzle solving, we we better have some coffee. And in the meantime, snow has begun to fall really heavily here. Okay, lots of snowfall now. Hopefully, won't affect uh, my internet connection. We'll see. So, okay, what are we missing? Oops. Dark tunnel and a ramp. something. It's hot here, and it's glowing down there. Ten to one, it's the power source for this place. All I need to do now is to find the light switch, or the plug, or the fuse box, 
or whatever makes this thing work. An instruction manual might help, maybe a map, and I could use a sandwich, and a hot jukebox and a cold beer, or just a starship headed for home. <sighs> Get a grip, Boston. Yeah. He's losing it already. Triangular button. Hmm. 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 Loose plate. It's a loose plate. It's a glowing blue crystal. This puzzle I do remember. Take a little bit of experimenting. Okay, that's the delete key. Let's try that. Where's the activate key? Crystal robot with this uh, panel. Let's see what that does. That's the grab, okay. I wanted to grab the lens at the bottom here. Let's try that. So I think it has to go down further and then use the grab function. I'm guessing that the red one is the grab function since you could only Program one, so let's see. Oh, okay, that was the wrong way. Puzzles in this game are, are kind of like this uh, experimentation puzzles. There we go. Awesome. And now we have uh, the lens, so now we have to uh, get it to adjust that lens. Really don't remember how to do that, but sure we'll figure it out. Don't even remember which lens it was actually. I needed adjusting to put it back.
take a look. This one has to be. Oh, it's a lens slot, okay. The lens is missing. Attached the lens there. I think four was good, but maybe one off. the correct door there. Awesome. This rock fell from the ceiling. It must have cracked open an energy conduit under the floor. So much for the cafeteria idea. Boston, are you there? I just got the power turned on and a door opened up here. They use geometric shapes as a kind of combination for the locks. Boston, you won't believe where I am. I'm in a place filled with alien technology, the most fantastic things I've ever seen. And the machines are working. What are they doing? I don't know yet. I mean, they're really alien. Like nothing I've seen before. Don't go too fast, Maggie. I'll be careful, Boston. But it's not like we have time to use correct scientific procedures to test these things. Where are you? How can I get to you? I wish I knew. It's a sure thing you can't get here the way I did. I slid through a low tunnel in the rock, and then it kind of got filled with debris when the roof collapsed. You could have been killed. Gee, I guess this isn't safe. But if we'd been together, whoever went through the crack second would definitely have been killed. Keep that in mind when you're thinking about coming to save me. I handled it just fine. Yeah, I guess you did. We're both doing okay, Boston. We'll find a way to connect up with each other when it matters. Uh, Maggie, good work. Thanks, Boston.
the button to call the tram. The tram seems to be made of crystal. No graffiti either. Now I know what my pet hamster felt like. I hope he was stabilized in there. Weakened door. An earthquake appears to have jammed this door closed. Mm hmm. I need some help to pry this door open. Weaken door and ruin the door. Not so promising. Nothing could open this door. Oh yeah. Remember this. These bones are preserved in the rock. Water. Plenty of water here. If it's drinkable, then we won't die right away. We'll have plenty of time to starve to death. I like how he suddenly is behind the rock over there. I see a cave down there. I wouldn't mind getting a look at that underwater cave. But I'm not really interested in finding out if this creature bites. were here, I'd tell her not to take a chance on swimming in the same water with a large eel that may or may not think of her as dinner. So maybe I'll take my own advice and stay on dry land. Six-legged turtle. It makes me wonder if they have a common ancestor back on Earth, unless it's just a coincidence of parallel evolution. A six-legged turtle-like creature. Kill it with a tusk and eat it. I don't want to frighten him away. frighten him away. <laughs> if Maggie were here, I'd tell her not to take a chance on swimming in the same water with a large eel that may or may not think of her as dinner. So maybe I'll take my own advice and stay on dry land. <laughs> Hmm, yeah, let's 
lots of things to do. Remember what to do, but not exactly in what order to do them, so we'll see. Panel. Whoa. Another ghost. The last one pointed the way down into the Nexus. Of course, that's how Brink died. True. can't use these two things together. I can't use these two things together. Yes, we need a screwdriver. A bunch of displays set into the walls. Inscriptions here and there. I'd say it looks like some kind of museum. Crystal, green, it almost looks alive. Strange glowing crystals. It's a stone tablet embedded in the wall. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. comes the chicken. Kind of. Could this be some sort of burial chamber?
red engraved rod. Another one of these engravings on a stick. That canister sure packs a punch. Yeah, some kind of explosive. Yeah, found. Boston! Robin. Maggie, I found you! I wasn't aware that I was missing. You know what I mean. I found a way to get where you are. Through the museum, back that way. That's nice, Boston. If that's the museum, then I guess this is the library. I found out how to open doors back in the Nexus. There's a tram that leads out here. Look, Boston, I think it's great you're finding things out, but I'm trying to concentrate here. I feel like I'm so close to making sense of some of this stuff, and I just want to stay here and keep working. All right? Sure, of course. I just... Anyway, I know where to find you, and you know how to get out of here if you want to. Thanks. Yes. When I learn something, I'll call you on the box, okay? All right. All right, yes. I, I won't bug you anymore right now. I've decided that has to be a control console for a data retrieval system. When I use the controls, different inscriptions appear, sometimes different languages. If English comes up, I'll let you know. Robbins. How are you doing with your data retrieval? I'm retrieving, I'm just not understanding. But you're pretty sure it's their language. I don't know. Just like the museum you found, I think this library was meant to be used by lots of different species. I think this language may have been especially designed to be easy to translate. If it's easy, why is it taking so long? It's easy compared to translating a genuinely alien language that you've never heard spoken aloud. Give me a break, Boston. I think I've got a handle on a couple of the symbols, but I have to test it out and see if it makes sense. I'm thinking that maybe we should consider teaming up again. Why? I think the answer to getting home is here in these displays. You go out and explore like you have been, and I'll work at getting us home. When I figure it out, I'll take you with me. No charge. Do you think it's possible to raise the dead? Spiritually, yes. I've witnessed many ceremonies. Physically rejuvenate, I'm not sure. Why? Oh, probably nothing. Maggie, I found a plate like the ones in the asteroid that triggered our journey here. For all we know, any plates we find might send us on a voyage to the opposite edge of the galaxy. Tell you what, I'll keep looking for more of them and you decipher that language so we can read the directions. Great. You get to look for metal things lying around on the ground while I have to decode a completely alien language without any information about how they think or what they might be writing about. Yeah, that's a fair division of labor. Thanks. I'm gonna throw her out of the spaceship when we finally start our voyage back. Screens must be part of one large computer. But we found more rods, so we can open lots of doors. And we found those uh, glowing crystals. Symbols written on a plate. Looks like an alphabet. Oh. Interesting. 
Maybe I should have shown that actually to, to Maggie. Yes? I found this in the museum. Can you read it? It's not the same set of symbols I'm finding in the database here. I don't think it's designed for strangers to be able to read it. didn't do what I expected it to. Supposed to get eaten and spit up again. That's what I remember. A six legged turtle like creature. Maybe later. 